this style is bomb, y'all. I look like I spent five hours. Wait, how long we spent in the shops? Hold on real quick. I look like I spent 10 hours in the shop. That's how long we spent for a style like this. my channel i'm your girl miss chrissy christina what a k hey christina what a k hey 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 girl hey boy how you doing how you feeling welcome back to my channel <laughs> today we're talking about this braided wig on my head is it a wig or did she get her hair braided <laughs> I'm gonna be talking about this wig sent to us by Fabulosity Hair. I'm gonna show you guys how I put this wig on, you know, cause two seconds, we don't have time to be braiding up our hair like this. Before we get started, make sure you give this video a big thumbs up for me. Hit that subscribe button. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's right there. <laughs> Hit that subscribe button and I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. this wig real quick i have to change my contacts because every time i record these videos my contacts specifically this eye it be acting up it be acting up why does this right eye not want me to be great i think with my glitter and my makeup i think i'm allergic because even my nose start running and everything y'all probably like why is her nose always running and her eyes are always red in these wig reviews y'all i think i'm allergic to miss chrissy <laughs> So this wig is sent to us by Fabulosity Hair. So I do have the braided ponytail style in the style of Miss Sheila. And this wig retails for $178. This is a lace frontal wig, okay? As you saw, the lace is in the front, giving all this illusion of braided goodness. It says the production time is about three weeks and also it's 28 inches. So this is what she's looking like as far as the length. Oh, I got a scoop back y'all this wig is too long for this camera <laughs> so this is what she's looking like as far as the length she's kind of coming down to my belly button if i would like you know tippy toe and this is what she's looking like in the back she's cute and she's coming tapered down in the back 
I know I sound like I have a cold right now, but I, I really do feel like I'm allergic to something in my makeup or something like that. So forgive me. My nose start getting stuffy. <laughs> my nose start running. My eyes start running. Something is not right, but I'm going to figure it out. So bear with me. I'm sorry, guys. But yeah, this is a nice braided wig. It does come with these nice cornrows right here. And then the wig kind of gets these nice braids. And it's nice and tapered all the way down. Look at that. Oh, I feel like I just left the shop, y'all. I did go in with some powder in the parting space right here just to kind of brighten up the parting space. Initially, I did start with a black wig cap, but then I went in with a brown one because I feel like the brown wig caps on these braided wigs kind of brightens up the cap. I did not tint the lace at all. And I did go in with powder in the parting space. So I swooped some baby hair, some adult hair, some some I don't want to go off to college hairs whoever you want to call these hairs I did swoop some in the front you could either cut it all off or use them to your liking I feel like with these braided wigs it kind of looks a little bit more natural when you go in with some baby hairs it just makes it look more natural I did secure this wig with this olive oil grip gel it is not glue or anything like that it is a short-term adhesive so if you feel like you need to use something else definitely use that but for the most part she is secure y'all and I have used this grip gel in other wig reviews I feel like it's gonna hold it for like at least two days or three days maybe you know with some refreshing but definitely consider using maybe a glue or some kind of other adhesive if you want to wear it more long term. But I think this and some bed head spray would definitely hold up. I think now this style is definitely one of those styles that you can't do much with. This is what you pay for, okay? So understand what you're paying for. You're paying for this style. <laughs> but I'm okay with that because this style is bomb, y'all. I look like I spent five hours. Wait. How long we spend in the shops? Hold on real quick. I look like I spent 10 hours in the shop. That's how long we spend for a style like this. And I spent 10 hours in the shop. Now granted, I did start this wig review during the day and the beauty of wigs and specifically braided wigs. I put this wig on when I started the beginning of the day. I think I said this in my last Fabulosity wig review. I have reviewed a Fabulosity wig before. The beauty of braided wigs is you put them on, you melt them, you do what you need to do in life. <laughs> Let me put a disclaimer out there of what happened today. I melted this wig in the beginning of the day. I think I started around 11 o'clock melting this wig. The sun was bright. It was looking lovely. But the reality is my kids had Zoom and then my rental car broke down. Yes, rental car because my car got stolen. Catch up on the catch up on the videos if you don't know what I'm talking about so I had to go and try to get that fixed I went to Trader Joe's I had to fix school lunches I had to like tell my husband that I love him you know you know what I'm saying but the point is with this braided wig the fact that I glued it and I secured it and as I was doing all of that and it was melting okay as it was on my head I did all these things that's the beauty of a braided wig you can get the look and I have to sit in nobody's shop watching nobody's movies do you understand what I'm saying to you do you understand I think this is definitely quality as far as the braids goes this is what she's looking like like look at these braids definitely quality this white stuff right here I think that's some of the gel or the hairspray but this is definitely quality when it comes to braids. As far as the cap, I think it's just a standard cap. I have a large cap. The back I wish was a little bit bigger with going down to the back. I'm not pulling the back down that far. If it had a comb, it would be better. There are no combs in this unit. That's one thing I don't like about this unit is the fact that there are no combs, but combs can be added. So it's not that serious. So I can't pull it, but it is stretchy. I was able to pull this wig down. I secured her. She's on my head. She's looking great. Initially, she kind of did feel a little bit heavy as well. 
but now that she's on my head she feels fine I think this is a look <laughs> y'all this is a look for my vacation my wedding my prom night whatever kind of night this is a look and you don't have to go to the shop and pay for it so I definitely do like this wig I also did start off with this bonnet <laughs> you know I showed you guys that this is the bonnet that they sent and it's cool because when you want to go to sleep this bonnet is so big that you can put all of the braids in the bonnet. So I like the fact that they made this bonnet and they send that to you. They have a lot of different other styles if you're not just feeling this style. I did review another style last month. I'll leave a link right here. And they have plenty of styles, but braided wigs are it, y'all. If you're looking for the style, if you're looking for, you know, that look and you don't want to stay in the shop, this is definitely it. Let me know what you guys are thinking about this wig. I will leave a link below to where you can purchase this wig. And until next time, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.